Princess Olivia. You are the fairest of all. My turn! Again? You've been the fairest four times already. <gasps> Let's do the Princess Pledge! Look who's here, girls. Daisy? I heard from Julian, who heard from Harold, who heard from Alexandra, that you were playing princess. Sorry I'm late, did I miss anything? We were just about to do the princess pledge. What princess pledge? The one I made up. A princess promises to be pretty, peppy, smell nice, sparkle a lot, sing happy songs very loudly, and never, ever be mean. My turn. <clears throat> A princess promises to be pretty, peppy, smell nice, and sparkle a lot. Sing happy songs very loudly and... Oh, yeah. And never, ever be mean. Rawr! I am a dragon! I am taking this princess as my prisoner! Ian! What? Every princess needs a dragon. That's not a dragon. No dragon, Ian. <sighs> I don't get it. If you don't want to be taken prisoner by a dragon, what's so great about being a princess? <gasps> what's so great about being a princess? Besides everything? When you're a princess, you get to wear a crown with a golden necklace and a fancy silk gown. You're a royal highness, your mother's the queen. Your house is a castle that you never have to clean. Your pet is a Rather be a robot. Princesses, exciting news. The royal family of Pashtonia is coming to Maywood. Yay! They're staying at their vacation castle just outside of town. Yay! A real live king and queen? <laughs> and they're bringing their daughter, Princess Stephanie. Yay! I can't believe it! Oh, oh, so Can we meet her? I don't see why not. The whole town is invited to greet them at the airport. <laughs> We're gonna meet a real live princess. Oh, brother. There's the king and queen. But where's the princess? Oh, Olivia, you made it. Yoo-hoo! Oh, no! The princess was so beautiful. Did you see that dress? I saw her back, I think. I'm sorry it didn't work out, Olivia. <laughs> hey, Olivia, you know what's better than seeing a princess? Cherry, Cherry Chunk, Chunk Ice, ice Cream! cream! Excuse me, Madam Driver, would you please take us to the nearest ice cream shop? Your wish is my command, Your Majesty. We're here. Woo ice cream! <laughs> Excuse me. <gasps> the royal family! It seems our carriage has broken a wheel, but none of us knows how to fix it. Well, Mr. King, sir, uh, I think I can help. Uh, this could take a while. Maybe Your Highnesses would like to go inside for some ice cream. Did someone say ice cream? <gasps> Princess Stephanie! Whoa! Are you all right? Silly dress. Thank you for... <gasps> you look just like me! Ready for ice cream? Cherry chunk ice, ice cream! cream. <gasps> So what do you think? Mmm, it's ever so yummy. I meant, what do you think about being a princess? It's okay, I guess. What do you do first in the morning? Ride a pony? 
or have tea, or walk through your own private flower garden? You look like someone I know. Ian, stop bothering the princess. My dress! A princess must never have a messy dress. I'll help you clean up. Come on. Let me go with you. I'll wait out here. I'm sorry about the spill. Not to worry. I have 50 more gowns exactly like this. 50? At least. Can I tell you a secret? They all itch. <laughs> oh, <laughs> but you get to go to fancy balls in your dress. I've never even been to a ball. Balls are all right, but you get to go to school and play with other children. And I bet you get to make a mess. Oh, I wish I could do that, even for a day. We really look alike. Exactly alike. We do, except your ears are bigger. And you have freckles. Other than that, no, no one, one could, could tell, tell us, us apart. apart. We should switch places for the day. But we can't pretend to be each other forever. How will we switch back? We ask our parents to bring us to this ice cream parlor tomorrow after dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Now let's swap dresses. <laughs> what a you make a pretty good mechanic. Come along, Stephanie. We must be on our way. <laughs> See you later, Olivia. Ta-ta, Princess Stephanie. She looks really familiar. Thank you again for helping us fix our carriage wheel. Getting my hands dirty was most thrilling. It's been a pleasure, Your Majesty. Bye, Your Majesty. Wow, princess for a day. Thank you, thank you. That's our castle? I mean, that's our castle. And it's amazing. <gasps> this is everything I dreamed it would be. <laughs> it's exactly like our castle back home, sweetheart. Uh, that's what I dreamed it would be. <laughs> <laughs> if the princess would follow me. I have a better idea. Why don't you follow me? Catch me if you can! <laughs> Thank you, Hogsworth. And maybe something more to eat? Once more around the castle, Duchess? Do you think Princess Stephanie is having as much fun being me as I am being her? Look at me! A princess making noise! I command you to fetch! Whoa! <laughs> what a mess! <laughs> What will we be having to eat, Mumsy? Pheasant under glass on a silver platter? Huh? A sandwich on a paper plate? How delightful! Ready for bed, dear? I can't find any red pajamas. <laughs> of course not. All your clothes are princess purple. All? Into bed now. But I'm not tired. Let's sing a song instead. Sing a song at bedtime? We could sing about all the princessy things I still need to do. Absolutely not. Singing before sleep would be most unroyal. But, but. No buts. Our royal good night. They say. Good night, Olivia. Your big day is through. But how can I sleep when I wish my real mom and dad were here with me, too? 
Good night, Olivia. Oh, goody! Have you brought me my milkshake? Goody? Wait, what milkshake? The yummy chocolate one I always have before going to bed. You give her milkshakes before bed? In her dreams. <laughs> Olivia, go to bed. And no milkshakes. If only my real parents were here. Pretending to be someone else was fun for a day. But now, I just want to go home. It's been such fun to wear this dress, to have a dog and make a mess. But now I miss the room I call my own. And so it's time. I want to go home. I was a princess. I made some noise. I had a butler. I played with other girls and boys. It was the greatest day I've ever known. But now it's done. And I want to go home. go to sleep, the sooner it's tomorrow, and I get to go home. <sighs> Good morning, Stephanie. Morning, Queen Mom. Morning, King Dad. Can we go to the ice cream parlor after dinner tonight? And invite that nice family we met yesterday to join us? I'm afraid that won't be possible. Some royal business came up and we have to return home this afternoon. This afternoon? No ice cream parlor? Yes. Back to Pashtonia. Oh, no. This isn't good. Olivia, can you get that? Hello? This is not Princess Stephanie. It's you. I mean, it's me, Olivia. We've got a problem. Your mother and father are going back to Pashtonia this afternoon, before dinner. This afternoon? But they can't. I'm here. They'll leave me behind. And they'll take me with them. We've got to switch back. Hmm. Wait, I've got an idea. I knew you'd think of something, Olivia. Let's have a going away party. A party? But whom would we invite? How about that nice girl from the ice cream parlor? Olivia and her family. Ah, yes, I see. It would be our way of thanking them for helping us fix our wheel. <laughs> what a jolly idea, Stephanie. And we can invite my... I mean, Olivia's whole class, too. All right, Princess. But immediately after the party, we fly back to Pashtonia. Royal business, you know. Got it. I'll go make the invitation. Did she say, make the invitations? Hi, Hi Olivia. Olivia! Uh, oh, that's me. Hello, classmates. Hmm, do you ever bow to Olivia? Uh, that's no. ever bow to you? I didn't think so. Ah, the royal throne. Doing? That's Mrs. Hagenmuller's chair. It is? Oh, I mean, it is. Good morning, class. Good morning, Mrs. Hagenmuller. Excuse me, ma'am. I have a special invitation from Princess Stephanie. Oh, that must be for me. <gasps> oh, my. Class, I've got some wonderful news. Princess Stephanie has invited all of us... All of us? ...and our families to a goodbye party this afternoon at the Royal Holiday Castle. Oh, yes. yes! I can't, I can't wait. wait! Hurry, 
family members, we don't want to be late for the royal party. The princess need fear no dragons today. Now with Sir Ian around. Everyone ready? Let's go. Home at last. Hello, thanks for coming. Hello, thanks for coming. I wish my family would hurry up and get here. Greetings, Princess Stephanie. Oh, no, 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 no! Why, Princess, I had no idea you talked turkey. Neither did I. Greetings, Princess Stephanie. My friends, I've missed you. Uh, Princess? <clears throat> uh, yes, we're, uh, very friendly in Poshtonia. Hey, do you know if that girl Olivia is coming? You know Olivia? Of course, doesn't everybody? She said she was coming with her whole family. Please, make yourselves at home. <sighs> Mom, Dad, where are you? Wouldn't you know it? I left my tools in the royal carriage when I fixed their wheel. Look, maybe they can help. Toodaloo! Bye, Olivia! <sighs> Just know we're gonna be best friends. Like go, we'll share clothes and go to lots of parties. Baby. And we'll... <gasps> you know my name. She knows my name. Well, it was a wonderful party, but we must fly off now. Five more minutes. Some of the guests haven't arrived yet. I'm sorry, dear, but it really is time to go back to Poshtonia. Wait, there's something I have to tell you. <sighs> I'm not really Princess Stephanie. I'm Olivia. Please, Stephanie, we don't have time. We must go. Mrs. Hogenmuller, Francine, tell them who I am. Why, you're Princess Stephanie. No, I'm Olivia. Look. I have bigger ears, no freckles. And look. <gasps> princess, you're not wearing purple. I'm not the princess. Oh, this jest has gone on long enough. We have to get on our plane. Now, pledge to me that you'll behave like a proper princess. <gasps> That's it! The princess pledge! What? There is no such thing as a princess pledge. Maybe not in Postonia, but there is here in Maywood. A princess promises to be pretty, peppy, smell nice, Sparkle a lot, sing happy songs very loudly, and never, ever be mean. Olivia, it really is you. I can't believe it. I hugged you. But if this is Olivia, where is Princess Stephanie? Oh, I think I know. Excuse me, good sir. Could you use some help? Mom! I knew I'd seen her somewhere before. It seems our daughters have switched places. Olivia? It's true, but I'm sure glad to be home. <laughs> Hi, Perry. And now it's time to switch back. Good heavens, Princess Stephanie, there's doggy slobber on the royal dress. Yes, Mother. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm afraid we must be going. We do have a plane to catch. Just one more minute. I had so much fun being you, Olivia. And it was really fun pretending to be you. But now I'm glad I'm back being me. Me too. Promise we'll be friends forever, Olivia. Ever and ever, Princess Stephanie. And I rode a pony, and had a tea party, and even wore purple pajamas. And I played with the dog, and I ate a sandwich on a paper plate, and I played the drums. You had quite an adventure, but I'm so glad you're back home safe and sound. Now get some sleep. They say good night, Olivia, your big day is through. But how can I sleep? There's still so much to do. It looks like I'm tucked inside, snug in my bed. But 
tomorrow is chasing today through my head. Will I climb the highest mountain top or will I paint my masterpiece? Go ride a bronco in the rodeo or wild the crowd on my trapeze. Princess, doctor, author, astronaut, from jungle stock to ocean deep. to be home. Good night, my little princess.